Hi there folks, it's Jeff Living here, and today I want to talk to you about the Balfang UV5R ham radio. Now, this is something that um, I think a lot of people should probably have um, for emergency situations. Now, um, having something like this um, is not recommended unless you belong to the ham radio community. However, you can still own one and use it only in emergency situations for being located. Now, I don't know enough about this yet uh, to give you a tutorial on it, and so I'm not going to be doing that. That's not what this is about. What it is about is talking about having something with you that's reliable for getting in touch with people if you absolutely need to. So, one of the best things that you can actually have with you, especially if you're in a wilderness situation or an emergency situation, is a good cell phone and this. So, I'm going to briefly talk about um, what we got on this. And, um, like I said, um, I'm not going to talk too much about um, how to program it and stuff like that because... I simply don't know enough about it yet. However, there are all kinds of YouTube videos, and all you have to do is um, type in uh, UV Fiber Balfang Radio, and um, you will get all kinds of tutorials on the proper way to program and use this thing. All right, first let's talk about some of the accessories. Now, over here, there's your battery on the back. And you got these two screws here, and what they do is they hold on this belt clip. And it takes, you know, literally 30 seconds uh, to put a belt clip on or take a belt clip off. And so that way, you're going to have um, an easy way to carry this without actually having to have it in your hand all the time. It also comes with a linear strap. And that hooks up just over here quite easily. Um, as you can see, there's an antenna here. Here's a slightly longer antenna, which is known as the rubber duck. And um, it, it's pretty important to have a slightly longer antenna. This one here only does short range. Um, but um, all of these are line of sight, but um, this is going to give you a little bit more boost. And then, of course, you have these longer ones here. And this is something that if you're going to be out on the wilderness, I strongly recommend that you carry something of this size. And all of these products are available from Balfang. Okay, what else comes with this? Well, we have this um, this cord here, which is the programming cord, and it just plugs into this side here. If I can actually get it off. There we go. And you would plug this cord in here, and then plug the other end into the USB on your computer. And then you can actually use this to uh, pro program in um, any of the uh, different channels that you need to uh, monitor. Now at the moment, um, I've only manually, and you can do it manually as well, uh, programmed in uh, a weather channel, a local weather channel, and uh, the Maritime Channel, because I live next to the sea, and um, I like to keep track of what's happening with uh, boats and, and uh, maritime traffic. Okay, other things that you can get with it is there's this uh, earbuds, which is like a hands-free kit. 
and um, that comes in very handy as well. Now you can get some larger um, accessories as well. If you look down here, you'll see that I've got a um, a hand mic, and that is attached to this chest strap here. And on the back, there's a zippy compartment, which is good for holding your wallet or just uh, some small personal items like that. On the front, we have a pouch here, which is good for keeping spare batteries for your bar frame. And then you can actually hold two of the bar fangs here in the front pocket. And this is difficult to do on camera, but there you go. And they put in the like that. And there's the same on the other side as well. So, yeah, um, you will have to check your local laws to find out um, if in your area it is legal or not to carry something that, like the bar fan. Um, as I stated earlier, um, this is something that um, uh, ham radio operators would use. And so if you're going to buy something like this and use something like this, it's strongly recommended that you contact your local ham radio um, group and um, perhaps get started and um, getting your certifications in that. Otherwise, you're not legally allowed to use something like this unless it is a specific emergency. Okay, just one other thing here. I have got, uh, which comes with the shoulder strap, a, um, another way to carry the bar fan, which is like so. And that just clips into the front. That way, this is really good if you uh, if you're wearing a pack. Uh, you can just throw this over your shoulder, and it's easy to carry. And it is removable. And then on the back as well is another way that you can carry this on your belt. And and so there you go. This is something. Um, that I need to learn a bit more about. But oh, by the way, it comes with this uh, charging stand here. I should point that out. It's easy to recharge. <clears throat> so yeah, this is something that I want to learn more about. Panel mode. But um, ha haven't got around to doing so yet with the COVID-19 you know, that horrible shit that's going on. But, um, yeah, I, like I said, between this and um, a decent cell phone, these are two ways which you can really protect yourself and your family and look after yourself in an emergency or bad situation. So check them out. Uh, you can get these on Amazon for um, a, a pretty reasonable price. And um, all of the uh, all of the aftermarket uh, products are again um, on Amazon for a very reasonable price. And um, well, that's going to do it for this one. So there you go, folks. Make sure that you and the family are protected, um, whether you're at home or whether you're in an emergency or whether you're. Um, out in the wilderness somewhere, you're going to want something like this. All right, folks. Until next time, this is Jeff Slayton saying, stay in touch. All right, folks. We'll see you later. Bye.